Nancy. And I'm Chloe. Welcome to BBC News School Report. Our top story today is Where's Roddy Fun Run on the 24th of March? Staff from DSTC took part in this event at Central London, battling through the wind and snow. They successfully completed 10k when it started at 11am at Victoria's Park. Over 1,000 people came to run for fun for the National Literacy Trust to help children and adults improve their literacy skills. Over to Evie at DSTC to interview some of the teachers that took part. Did it. Uh, to raise money for a charity, which was for literacy. Uh -huh. National Literacy Trust, I think that's what it's called. Yeah. What did you have to do? Yeah, you start. Well, we walked uh, 10 kilometres, it was either 5 kilometres or 10. And it was in a park, so you had a little circuit to do, and like a loop, loop you did twice. And it was windy, and it was cold, and it was snowy. Did you practice for it? Of course not! <laughs> <laughs> um, did you have a routine? Um, what do you mean by Walk. routine? Walk. <laughs> at first we walked like this, that was a routine, and at the end it was more like... <laughs> true, true, true. How was it? Uh, cold. <laughs> Uh, it was fun. fun. Yeah. It was fun. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it was fun. There was a lot of people, and obviously seeing all the wallies dressed like this at the beginning was quite nice. Of you. What charity does it go to? No, it's this National Literacy Trust. Yeah. How did it help the charity? Um, how did it help? Well, we raised money for it, and we raised uh, one thousand two hundred. Yeah. Like that. Something like that. Pounds, so that's going to go to the charity, obviously, and they're going to use it to help children to read at school, buy books, do events, things like that. How did you overcome the weather conditions? <laughs> did we? <laughs> By wearing about 28 layers of clothing. Yeah. Hats, collect. gloves, everything, but yeah. it wasn't that cold once you got going, and it wasn't actually snowing heavy, so that was okay. That's all from us today. You've been watching BBC News School Report. Woo! <laughs>